Welcome to my channel. I'm going to be doing this masquerade mask look today, which I, I did almost two years back on my Instagram, which is originally inspired by Bonnie Corbin here on YouTube. I'm first going in with my Hourglass Vanish Seamless Finish Foundation Stick in the shade Buff. Then I'm going to take my Real Techniques sponge and blend that into my skin and down the neck. I'm going to take my LA Girl Pro HD Concealer in the shade Creamy Beige to hide any blemishes. I'll then take my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Light Sand to highlight my under eyes, chin, and mouth. Then I'm going to take my LA Girl Concealer in the shade Almond to contour. Then I'll just set my face with any type of translucent powder and a big fluffy brush. I'm going to take my Kat Von D Shade Light Palette to contour and highlight. Then I'm going to take my Becca Cosmetics Jaclyn Hill Face Palette and use the blush in the shade Amaretto for my cheeks. Then I'm going to take my Nicole Guerrero Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit to highlight. I'm then going to go in with my Tartlet in Bloom palette with the shade Charmer and put that all over my lid. Then I'm going to go in with Smarty Pants and Sweetheart from the same palette as the transition color. I'm going to use Rebel in the crease and Leader in the outer corner. Then I'm taking Funny Girl and putting that all over the lid. I did my liner and lashes off camera because I haven't mastered doing it on camera yet. Bear with me. Then I'm going to take my NYX lip liner in Auburn and fill in my lips. Then 
then go over that with uh, the NARS lipstick in Cruella. And then I'm going to take my Tarte Lights Camera Lashes Mascara and coat my lids. Don't you just love when that happens? Then I'm going to start splitting some tissue paper in half to prep it for the face. You can use any pencil you want to outline where your face is going to be cut off. I just use this one because it's the closest to me. I'm going to put a layer of liquid latex down around the outline. Then add the tissue paper on top of that, followed by another layer of latex. I probably repeated this about two or three times. Once that's dry, you can start peeling some of the latex away from your skin to give it a torn effect. Once you're happy with that, you can blend it in with some foundation or concealer.
Then I'm going to take my contour kit again just to blend in the, into the skin a bit more. I'm going to take the Lime Prime Venus palette and use the shade Moose to give my skin an irritated look. You can use any matte red for this if you want. Then I'm going to take my Ben Nye Pro FX palette and start filling in the space with a mix of dark red. Once that's done, I'm going to go in with some Ben Nye scab blood all over the area. Then finishing it off with some stage blood by Ben Nye. And that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe and leave me a thumbs up if you did. Let me know in the comments what you guys would like to see next. Thanks for watching.